All right, so the next thing we're gonna look at is adding text. Now there's two main ways to add text. You'll notice on the insert button, insert tab over here, there's a text box. So if I click on text box, it's gonna pop that up right there for me. I can then drag it if I would like to. I can type in there, uh, feel free to contact me. Keep it as that for now. Same options as the banner, I can make that really large or smaller, depending on how I would like it. I also have section background. So a couple color schemes. There's gonna be the one that's gonna match the normal background and one that'll kind of match some of the other colors there. You could also do an image as a background. You wanna be careful with that because sometimes it ends up blocking the text, but that is an option. If I have something that needs to be duplicated, I can do that and it'll duplicate that same one. If I don't need it, hit the trash can and it disappears. I'm gonna push that in there. Keep that, there we go. So that was clicking on text box. Another way that comes in handy as you start adding to your site is to just double click. So I'm gonna be in this area here, I'm gonna double click my mouse and it pops up this little circle and text is right in the middle, just kind of a shortcut for you there. So I'm gonna click that one out. But those are your basic ways of adding text. I can then drag things around. You'll notice as I do drag it, things pop up. You see here on the left and right there that that shows me I'm gonna be right in the middle if it's something that I wanted centered. So I move it to the middle, you see those pop up and I could leave it right there. Can also drag it, you see the moment when it gets below it and see how that changed there. So if I didn't like how that happened, I'm gonna click the undo button. Basically that's moving it off to a new section. All right, so that's adding text, so you might want to go to some of your pages and add that on there.